So the USA now enter into the list as they face France. Again, I'll see, I expect to see fairly even fight here. Looking at the uh, structure of the list this year, it seems to be holding up quite well. But uh, I'm not quite sure if I'm a fan of this one entry gate. Just from a, if we if we've got these larger fights, just yeah. getting people onto the field is taking much longer. It would be a practical decision to have one on either side, but it does take a very long time for the transition period. But not having them at the uh, at the ends is probably a, a great idea because. Uh, oh yeah. You know, the number of times that fights end up being at the back there and the gates end up being damaged and smashed yeah. and having to make jury rig repairs. Mm. These, these lists are holding up well. They've done a really good job. You can see in the, the shot there now the huge pieces of stone that they've used to, to hold them down, but they're still yeah. getting pushed around a little bit and deforming. Yeah, we saw but, yesterday uh, they were quite warped um, during the 12 versus 12. But generally speaking, they've held up really well. Yeah. something that we had to uh, start really pressing to the teams uh, in the five versus five stages on the first day was to mm. always enter from the gate. Uh, these, yeah. these lists are very easy just for, for reserve to duck under at their reserve ends, mm. but uh, it's very hard for the marshals then to keep an eye on safety for you know helmet straps and, and uh, other backs of necks well protected. And, That's you know, true, yeah. So everybody gets a quick check as they're coming through the gate. It, we don't mind you leaving under the barrier, but mm. if... Uh, if you're entering the field, you've always got to come in through the gate. Okay, sure. Mm. So the French advance forward against the United States. Weapon breakage already. Yeah. Uh, the Americans are going to get the breakthrough. We've got one done. loose fighter there, so we need he, to get back a great job of staying up. up. And two of them have uh, broken the line, however, the uh, French fighters there are really working hard to try and get him down. Oh, they have done, but it's taken one out. One out. He's taken an injury down. But he held up oh, five big fighters, take so down that, was there. Big, uh, that was a big advantage for them. Good work, you know, good use of space. Well, was being taken down at the same time in the middle as the now very widely spread out. Still hard to call who's got this one.
Looks like the French have got the advantage now. Hmm. It seems so, yeah. Uh, certainly on that side, as you can see. There's two Americans being held down, so I think this will be over fairly quickly. Well, there is a loose American fight in the middle there. Oh, the body's really strewn across the list. Well, this is a match. You can see how widely spread out all the action was. That's uh, thanks to those early breakaways by the American fighters, one of which was successful. This, uh, you can see this guy coming through on the right-hand side in a moment. Mm. And he tied up about five French guys for yeah. so long he yeah, managed to keep that. his feet. That yep. was excellent. It's a shame they couldn't capitalize on that. Here we go. Yeah, that was, uh, that was good work. It looks like there was something around the 15 mark victory for, for France. And he's still has some discussions. Seems to be some uh, discrepancy. Uh, yet another complaint from the American captain, which have been numerous this tournament, and some a little unjustified. But of course, if there is appeal, every team has the right to make two official appeals if they're not happy with the decision, which will be observed and checked by the tournament committee with the computers. And of course, if the appeal is successful, then they get their appeal form back. If it's unsuccessful, then they lose that. I witnessed a, 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 an interesting appeal earlier on today in the duels in the long sword. Oh. The uh, the Polish and Latvian competitors mm. went to four rounds. They wow. they tied every single round. Really? Uh, the first one, the first minute and a half was 14 each, I believe. Then it, they went to extra time, 30 seconds, mm. seven all. Went to an extra time, another one, seven all. Mm. And then initially wow. the the fourth round was called seven nine in Latvia's favour. Mm. And the Polish guy put in an appeal and it actually took quite an amount of time because I had to go back and watch the video of footage course, and yeah. recount from the video footage. And the Polish guy was actually upheld to have won the fight. Wow. Uh, and that could have seriously affected the uh, group because that then meant yep. that three fighters in the group had each won three fights. Mm -hmm. So they had to go back down to the points one mm. uh, total. And unfortunately for the Polish guy, he mm. still came third. Wow. Um, but, uh, so his appeal was successful, so their team yeah. got their, their appeal their card back. back. Yeah. Um, but you can see how that would have made a massive difference to that group. Oh, absolutely, um, yeah. So we had to hold back on the playoffs until mm. we could determine the results of that group. Mm -hmm. So we go into the second round of USA versus France. The Americans are a very strong team and uh, would surprise me if we'll see any a few more breakthroughs than very fast. And we do admire just how fast they are. They were very accurate also, very aggressive in the 12 versus 12 yesterday. A superb team. Uh, the, uh, you can see the Americans are really pushing the French back now. Mm. 
Well, that was a great breakthrough there. Superb words from the American fighter. Well, the French goes for the takedown, swings him round, can't quite get him. Ah, uh, it's a massive takedown in the middle. I think America might have this one. Well, it's a pass there from the French fighter. As you see, some clinches start to form. And that's good work from the French fighter to take down a couple of big USA fighters, thrown down a Frenchman. Very even, in fact. Big shots coming in from the uh, pole arm fighters and the USA fighters taking down a Frenchman. Very impressive. We'll watch out for that Franklin Frenchman now. Well, a lot of pressure coming in, but uh, you can see the Frenchman trying to take advantage of the pile of bodies there. Good job of keeping his feet and walking over them, though. No? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Again, he's actually going to have to walk over the bodies there. He didn't mean to, but... Oh, I'm good sure takedown now. The... Superb, massive takedown for the American. That's outstanding. I'm still having Frank. trouble calling this. At one stage, I thought the Americans had the upper hand, and now it looks like the French have. It's very hard to call. It's very yeah. hard to call. Well, this is a great round. <laughs> oh, another nice takedown. Big strikes coming. Running down on the American fighters there. So perhaps the French do have the advantage. Oh, good but job. Manages to stay up. But Well, that's another broken hold on. Okay. Well, that's a fight stop to the peers. You can see the good movement from the American fighters, very athletic, very aggressive. And there's a lot of power coming down with the French fighters. He great defensive move and a superb push. Just gets the better of him. That stack on the far side claimed a lot of scalps this, this time around. Yep. No, a big thrust there from look the French fighter. Look at that big fighter. pile there. <laughs> wow, look at that. Yeah. I do not want to be the guy on the bottom. No. 